Welcome to Minyurange. Today we are going to see premium features of LDAP for Joomla. In this video we are going to see attribute mapping and group mapping. While user log in to Joomla using LDAP credentials then we can automatically maps users attribute and assign groups to them. First of all, you have to enter all LDOP connection information details. Then click on test and save button. Your configuration has been saved successfully. Now enter search base. Enter search filter, please select as per given. Click on save button. Let's see attribute mapping. Now, we are going to configure the basic attribute mapping. Now enter your LDAP username and password. Click on test configuration button. Enter the username and then click on Test Attribute Mapping button. Here we can see attribute received of user. Enter your Active Directory attribute for Joomla attribute, for name as a Samakuntnam. For email enter as mail. You can add more attribute for Joomla. Enter the value of Active Directory attribute. Enter the value of user profile attribute. Click on Save Attribute Mapping button. Attributes saved successfully. Now go to Configure LDAP tab. Now click on the check to enable LDAP login. Click on Save button. Settings saved successfully. Enter the login URL and search it. Login with user's credentials. Login successfully. Let's see login user's details. Now go to users then click on manage. As we can see user is created, now click on this user. Click on user profile. As we see user's profile updated accordingly with attribute value. Click on Close. Let's see Group Mapping. Now, we are going to configure the Basic and Advanced Group Mapping. Click on Group Mapping tab. Now enable Group Mapping. You can select Default for Login Users as per your concern. For now we can select Registered. Now we can do Group Mapping for Joomla LDOP. You can map groups by getting from the Test Attribute Mapping section by entering the username in the Attribute Mapping tab. Now enter your LDOP group name. Assign Joomla group to this LDOP group name. Click on Add More Mapping button. For different LDOP group assign different Joomla group. Click on Save button. Now go to login page and login with different user to see group mapping feature. Login with user's credentials. Login successfully. Now go to user then click on manage. As we can see user is created with user groups as per given. Login successfully. Go to the user. As we can see user is created with user groups as per given. Now enable the checkbox of do not update existing users roles. Let's select another default group for login users to see how this feature works. Let's change the Joomla group also. For your usage, you can modify the groupings as needed. Click on Save button. Login with user's credentials. Login successfully. Go to the user. 
Here we can see existing users' roles are not updated. As we see other users also not updated. Congratulations! You have successfully tested features of the LDAP plugin. Minirange provides best single sign-on solution. Thanks for watching.